Stage 2 of NCPS Dadri consists of two units, each bearing a load capacity of 490 megawatts. The boilers of these units are of CE design and were manufactured by BHEL. The dimensions of 19.177 meters by 16.115 meters, the boiler has a volume capacity of 17,112 cubic meters. The boiler is a controlled circulated type boiler which means proper circulation of water through water walls is ensured by boiler circulation water pumps or BCW placed in down comer pipes. It is also a reflet tubing boiler. The boiler is balanced draft and a single drum top supported boiler. With a glimpse of the boiler, anyone can easily guess how complex a task is performed and efficiently managed by this finely implemented process. To break it down, a boiler consists of six major components that work in tandem. Water enters the boiler through economizer. Located in the boiler's back pass, the economizer consists of three banks that are arranged in horizontal rows. The economizer is primarily used to preheat water being fed into boiler. The water is heated by recovering the heat from exhaust gases escaping boiler. Water then flows into steam drum. Steam drum is used to separate water from steam generated inside the furnace walls. From the drum, water flows through downcomers to furnaces front wall water lower inlet header through PCW pumps. These PCW pumps or the boiler circulation water pump force circulation of water through the furnace's water walls. This rising water helps in absorbing the generated heat in the furnace. The mixture of water and steam is sent back to the drum for separation. The separated steam follows the steam circuit and the water is returned to water side of boiler drum for recirculation. The separated steam generated in this entire process flows through the radiant roof tube to back pass header. The steam goes to LTSH. From LTSH, steam flows to DPSH and finally to PSH. The steam at PSH outlet is main steam with 540 degrees Celsius temperature and 176 KSC pressure, which is discharged by HP turbine for work. After passing through HP turbine, the steam is introduced back into the heater where it is reheated for 568 degrees Celsius and is returned to IP turbine, thus completing cycle which has maximized the efficiency of reusability of water.